Daily Vlog. I'm back with it. I don't think I posted any vlogs last week, but of course you're gonna get some vlogs this week from your girl Minnie. So anyways, make sure you like, you comment, and you subscribe to the gang, y'all, cause you know you gotta be dedicated to the gang. Also, follow me on all social medias. Everything will be down in the description below. And yeah, you guys, let's go ahead and get right into this video. Me and Ted about to go, and we about to go take some pictures because your girl need to take some pictures because I look all good, all nice, all that. Check me out, check me out. Ooh, cute dress, cute sandals, purse, all that hair different. You, 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 you feel me? We about to go take me some pictures. Finna go find a, a location to go take some pictures at so I could take me some nice pictures for the gram. So by the time y'all see this video, I should have these pictures up. So make sure you go like them and follow me on the gram at mini.we with two T's. Go ahead and do that for me. But y'all, look at my baby. Like, check him out, y'all. He just seen here. Stop. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. I gotta take much. Yes, y'all. He smell like onions. Stop lying. He smell like onions, y'all. He got his legs open, feet out. Look at that. Y'all, he never liked being on mini game. Like, he do not like being on mini game. I don't know why, but it is what it is, cause we don't need him on mini game. I just know one thing for sure. You about to get up and come take my pictures. All right, you guys. So now I took my pictures earlier, but I don't know if they came out exactly how I wanted them. So I might don't post them. Cause I don't think they came out how I wanted them. But y'all, we at the place called Candy Shack, and y'all got me a cute little drink. Hey Max, cause I just grabbed a drink from him. We have a friend back from school that we know, and he's down here just visiting, visiting with us, just chilling with us for today. But yeah, y'all, we at this place called Candy Shack. I never had it before, but it looks like it's gonna be good. Aaron, why you walked away? I was trying to get you to say hey. What's going on, guys? <laughs> All right, you y'all. We leave it Candy Shack. It was good. I had the catfish, shrimp and fries. Sorry, y'all, my throat's um, <coughs> there. You go. I had the catfish, shrimp and fries. Ted had the wings, which was mango habanero, and it was really, really good. Really, really good. Like I liked the day wings. The catfish, it would have been ten times better if they had hot sauce, but they didn't have the hot sauce that I like. So that's why. I didn't really enjoy it so much, but the food is good. The way how they cook is good. Only thing I was missing was my hot sauce, but I still ate it because it's real good. So now we're really just about to head home. I'm sitting in the back seat because I want the boys to sit in the front. And plus, I just want to lay back and relax. So, but I just see y'all when I get All right, guys, so I made it back home and now I'm just chilling, you know. I just got a phone call from my girl Lex and I'm debating do I want to go out tonight? I'm not sure. I'm not sure if I want to. I might just go chill with her today. So I got to show y'all something while we right here, while we at it, while we talking. While we at it, while I came in here, I came in here to talk to you guys about this Dozier company, you guys. And y'all, but I'm just telling y'all about it because I sit here and I put it back in the box because I want it, you know, looking all fancy, all good how it is. I use this perfume and y'all, it smells so, so good. Like I like like how it smells like so natural. Like you know how it's not over the top, like, you know how you got strong perfumes? Like, it's not like no strong perfume. It's like just right. Like, it's in the middle. It's just right. Like, enough for people to smell you and, you know, say you smell good. You get what I'm saying? Even though I like strong scents too, but I like this because it's more of like a natural scent. Let me show y'all the box. Let me unbox it for y'all. So, we got this cute little box. And it come with this little thing with the company name. And y'all, it tells me... Well, all is contained in my perfume. So the perfume I have is the fruit and honey flavor. So look at this, y'all. I have the fruit and honey perfume, and I'm telling y'all, like, it smells so, so good. Like, I'm gonna spray it in just a minute, but let me, let me read this to you. So like, it's basically made out of like green leaves, honey, peach, you get what I'm saying? Like nectar, nectarine? Sorry, y'all, I'm saying this wrong. Nectarine and stuff like that. It just let me just spray it. Let, let me just spray this to y'all to see how y'all smell this. Y'all, it smells so good. It really do smell like peaches and honey, y'all. It smells so good. So I have the fruit honey flavor, and y'all, it smell extremely good. Like this fruit honey, that man. This fruity honey, it don't really smell like fruity honey, but it smell like peach and honey, y'all. 
and it smells so so good like i smell peaches i smell oranges i smell everything and it smells so so good y'all so i'm gonna leave their stuff down in the description i want y'all to go check them out i promise y'all like you won't go wrong with this perfume like i really do love this perfume this is going to be my everyday perfume y'all my everyday perfume because it just smells good and i love peaches and honey like i love the smell of peaches and honey it just smells sorry if i spit it it just smells so good so the company is called dozier i'm gonna go ahead and put everything up that about them under the, in the description y'all will see that website right here on the screen and the company name y'all like this this perfume this perfume y'all you're not gonna go wrong go ahead and shop with them go check them out they have many different flavors different scents they got many different scents y'all like i chose this one because like i said i love peaches and honey and i'm most definitely going on the site again to purchase me a new one because this just smell so good so y'all go check them out for me and you know get them a chance go ahead and get them one more chance well not one chance but get them their first chance if y'all want the flavor i got get the fruity honey this 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 good get the fruity honey but i am going on the site today to go order me a new one because this right here smells so so good like but anyways y'all like i'm just about to really just sit down and probably clean up i was gonna cook tonight i'm not sure if i want to because i did i got leftover seafood like and y'all know i i pick my seafood over anything i pick my seafood over anything I done dried these clothes probably like three days, three days ago. I dried, the, I dried these clothes three days ago and I still haven't folded them. So I think I need to take the time out right now and fold these clothes. Because if I don't fold them now, they're not going to ever get folded. So let me go ahead and get to doing that. I'll catch up with y'all later. All right, y'all. So as y'all see right now, my hair looking all crazy and stuff. I'm trying to really get it out of the crinkles because I finna curl my hair and go ahead and pin it up for tonight because tomorrow I want my hair to be flowing. You get what I'm saying? I want it to be flowing out everything. So I, I folded all my clothes. So the last thing I have to fold tomorrow is the towels. And plus I got to wash more towels. But it is what it is. You know, I got to I gotta do what I got to do. I'm trying to brush it, brush it out as much as possible because I want to curl this for tomorrow. I don't want to wear crinkles tomorrow. I want to wear curl. So I know y'all probably like, e, you always doing something to your hair. You always cleaning your hair. Well, y'all, it's kind of what I like to do. I like to try new things. That's the only way I'm going to get better. Like, I didn't get better from this overnight. Like, it took me time. Like, I really been playing in my head since 12th grade, I would say. 12th grade was my very first time ever playing in my head. And I um, did my first frontal install for my birthday when I was in 12th grade. And y'all, it was so ugly, like, so ugly compared to what frontals and stuff look like now. I brushed it out enough. I hope this enough. I'm just gonna curl over. I'm not gonna. So I'm just gonna grab my curlers and just get the curling. Ooh. I don't know, y'all. Like, should I curl it tonight? Now I'm just being lazy because now I don't even know if I want to curl tonight. But I do want to curl it because I want to go ahead and pin it up for tomorrow. I just hope it don't be, like, crinkle curl because, like... <laughs> I don't want it to be like that. I, that's that's going to be really ugly if it's like crinky curl. If it's crinky curl, I'm going to do it tomorrow. So I'm going to do one curl with y'all. One little curl ain't going to hurt you. One little curl ain't going to hurt you. Y'all make sure y'all go follow me on TikTok. Go check me out. Go ch go watch my TikToks I did. It looks like I'm, I'm not going to be able to like curl it how I want to. Because this ain't going to work. I already can tell because it still got the crinkles in it. I'm going to have to flat iron then curl so. Flat irons need to hurry up and get hot. But y'all, I don't do the little comb method. I know a lot of people do like the comb method when they uh when they flat iron their hair. I do not do that. I just do it with a brush. Like I trace it with a brush. I don't trace it with a with a comb. Majority of the time, I do it with just my um my brush. Like I get my big brush. I just put it like this. Flat iron should be hot enough because I ain't gotta get it too straight. But I just do it like this. And I just go down like, got that screen out, see? Now it's screen enough to where I can curl it. Get this curl, that was hot too on my neck. But let me just go on curl. I'm using my big curlers, so I'm not gonna use my tiny curlers. I need to cut like little layer pieces, but I guess I'll do that in the morning. But then again, I need to do that tonight because I don't wanna end up doing it wrong. 
Ain't that right? I, I should do it tonight so I won't be doing it wrong tomorrow. But I just hold that. I count down 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, and I grab my pen, grab my pen, let the curl go, 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 go to the flow. Then you see that? See how I just fall down? And it's a big loose curl. Go ahead, AJ. Grab that thing. Come on, curl them. There we go. Got it all the way up there. So now it's time for me to pin. Most of the time I gotta put two pins on it because one pin just don't hold. At the same time, I might just use my flexi rods to hold it. Cause I never used my flexi rods before y'all. Like, I never used my flexi rods before like at all to hold my curl. And I feel like the flexi rod would probably give it a better hold cause it's be in there. Let me try to see, hold on. I need to open the zipper, act like it won't open. Come on, baby. Y'all, the zipper just broke. Now I just gotta get some scissors. So I'm just grab all these different sizes in here. So let me see if I loop it. Let me see what it'll do. Like, is it gonna hold up or is it gonna... I don't think I did that right, like. Try it on my next curl, huh? Well, actually, let me let me take this curl out and let me try to curl it like that. Y'all know how y'all be doing, like y'all be one curl and stuff. Like, how y'all be doing it? And y'all just do it like that, right? Can you do it like that? Then you just close it, right? I don't think that's gonna be right. No, I'm messing that curl all the way up. Like, I'm messing that up, like, up badly. So let me just, I should just lift it along. I messed it up. Trying to do something new and I messed it up. How about if I start from the top? I really don't know. Let me just recurl this and just stick to what I know. So y'all, look. I just sat here and I flexi rod my hair. I don't know if I did this right. So y'all comment down below and let me know if I did this right. But this is, this is, this is this just how it's gonna be for right now. I'm sure y'all the back. Yeah, got my grandma curlers in, yeah. Y'all, I need the, uh, well, I'm just gonna put my bonnet on because, like, all the little hairs, like, keep, I don't know, it's, like, freezing out, and I don't like that. Like, it's irritating me, so I'm gonna just put my bonnet on. So I got everything under my bonnet, and I'm about to go in the kitchen now because I'm gonna warm up my seafood. All right, you guys, I'm gonna put on my pajamas, but I got Ted's leftover seafood right here that I'm about to put on the stove in this boiler once the water start boiling and then I have my seafood. I didn't have mine in the bag because I had mine all spreaded out in that pan. Down there I got my sausage and stuff warming up but I'm gonna warm this up. Uh, I'm gonna either put mine in a bucket too or I may uh, put it in a microwave because I may put it in a microwave where I just gotta heat it up for like two minutes and it'll be hot, good, juicy, ready for me to eat. We just gonna see, actually the water is going ahead and start to boil now. So I think I'm gonna just go ahead and sit. I'm gonna see if I can fit both bags inside the boiler. If not, um, of course I'm gonna just only do Ted bag. Feel like I'll be able to sit both bags. Just let the bag steam for like 15 minutes and it should be all hot and ready. So that's what I'm about to do. Get this thing on hot and ready. So yeah, you guys, that's pretty much it for this vlog. I really didn't do much today, but I did a little bit, a little some, some. So you guys, I will see y'all on tomorrow. Make sure you like, you comment, and you subscribe to the gang. Comment down below more videos you would like to see. And yeah, you guys, I'm out.